I think uh, one factor that scared uh, women in my part of the world a lot um, in the maybe the 90s is when I really started to notice it and that was when women started clamoring for c-section certain women and I think it was because it became popular to um, lampoon natural birth in comedy series out of, coming out of Hollywood, it began to go into the films. So you either had this um, ridiculing of people would be so crazy as to home, have a home birth, and they were all stupid people and not likely to be good mothers, and objects of ridicule, really, gross, you know. So th that was the, you know, the, the stereotypical view of birth without submitting to all the technology. And then you also had, um, drama likes danger and so you wanted the adrenaline birth you know and so you had the woman who suddenly goes into labor and now we're off to the hospital and then you know somebody dies and uh, you know that kind of thing and so that really scared women then you put that together with these birth shows that became popular with the the cable and the satellite shows and so you were seeing real gritty births supposedly uh, but always women on their backs uh, with an epidural, and they're just enduring this horrible thing that the poor women have to go through. And you always saw birth as an ordeal, and then you would go, oh, the real thing must be really horrible if this is the good thing, you see. And so then when you would see the C-section, uh, it's so sanitized. Um, and most people aren't media sophisticated to know how edited everything is. And if they'd really been in the operating room and saw everything, they would come away with a different idea. Or if they saw the woman on, you know, the few hours after the C-section, when now she's got to get up and move so that she's not in danger of a deep vein thrombosis, um, how much pain she's in and, and how long it's going to be before she can lift her leg without pain. Um, you'd have a whole different view if you saw how much blood is lost in a C-section. And, and of course, you only see the good C-sections. So I think that if we could see real birth on television, and I tried to get mine out there, but you know what? They can't be seen because sometimes oh, a pubic hair is seen. So we are so puritanical in the U.S. I've had you know Australians tell me, well, we, we got the convicts, you got the Puritans, we got the better deal. <laughs> and I know what they're talking about. Unfortunately, though, um, the U.S. seems to be the world leader in childbirth um, style. And that's, that's a real shame unless more people can get that the U.S. home birth movement, which is actually growing, uh, we've now grown to 1% of all births. And that's taken 40 years, <laughs> but I'm encouraged by it. It could grow more.